Well, what's going on at the infrastructure level, at the environment level? Here is, for example, 3M developing its proprietary activities in the development of a new product, which it will then have to transfer and create a business functions of marketing, production, and management, and create various resource channels with producers and distributors and salespeople in order to make a business out of their particular innovation. As they engage in these proprietary activities, they run into infrastructure bottlenecks. And by that I mean you start thinking about the larger infrastructure of necessary activities and functions and resources that are needed to create an innovation. Any given proprietary technology is going to be relying upon a set of resource endowments. And those resource endowments include basic science and technological advances, financing and insurance arrangements, and competent people, training and accreditation. A new innovation, if it is a new innovation, is going to challenge institutional rules. And so institutional arrangements need to be revised. They need to be legitimate. It's okay to trigger and stimulate with electricity the human ear. Yeah. That's the legitimation question. The regulation and laws. The FDA will review this process to make sure that this whatever procedure you're using is safe and efficacious. And standards. Well, do we use high frequency? Do we use